Sabah Finance Minister Datuk Sri Masidi Manjun has warned against making premature comments about mega billion dollar projects involving the state government's name before doing fundamental assessments. According to Masidi, this will present the government as the punchline at a time when people are more concerned about matters such as reliable water supply and proper roads. He said, we cannot stop people from making these announcements, but when they try to tie it with the state, then a feasibility assessment should be first order. Saya pikir kita lebih berhati-hati daripada membuat pengumuman. Ya, ni kita hanya buat pengumuman setelah at least basic evaluation telah dijalankan. Ya. Arti dia kalau pelabur tu daripada luar negeri, seperti yang saya nyatakan tadi, kebiasaannya dia harus melalui dia tapi soli miti dulu kan? Ya. Itu ialah untuk memastikan we have kita memperlihi apa itu pelabur yang berwibawa lah. Ya. He said, announce it when it is feasible. He said Sabah has a population of only 3.9 million people and asked who would acquire a project involving 20,000 hectares. Umumlah apa yang patut, tapi biarlah pengumuman itu sesuatu yang dalam bahasa Inggeris sebagai realistically doable. Apa itu sesuatu yang uh, secara realistiknya boleh dilaksanakan. Kita juga akan ambil kira bahawa population kita atau penduduk kita cuma 3.9 juta. Kan, kan? Jadi bila kita mengatakan kita akan membuat industrial park sampai berpuluh-puluh ribu hektar, siapa yang mau boleh? Siapa yang misalan? Lah, kan, kan? Masidi said this when met after officiating at the state's accountability index system ceremony at Sutra Habu on Thursday. The state's accountability index system is used to facilitate financial audits and internal control of its agencies. He urged civil servants to be more proactive in collecting outstanding taxes. He said some agencies let companies slide for years, while others have not even sent a single payment letter. He said we need to be more proactive. After all, it is the people's money and it should be paid in full.